Hey guys, Ernie here and welcome to the Paleo Hiker MD channel. Got another awesome coffee video for you guys today. Now I get asked to do a lot of reviews and I'm out here in beautiful Arkansas in the Ozark Mountains. It's nice and chilly. It's about 35 degrees this morning and I'm wanting some coffee. Now I get asked to review a lot of products here on the channel. Some stuff you can't even imagine, just crazy stuff. And when I got asked by this company to review their coffee press, I thought, well, I've done a lot of French presses in the past. And this one kind of looked like some of the ones I've done. But after a pretty quick look online, I realized this is not your typical company and this is not your typical French press. So stay tuned and we're going to take a look at the Boulder Coffee Press from the company Coletti. Thanks for watching, guys. This is the Boulder. I like that Boulder. That is a nice Boulder. 10 cup insulated French press coffee maker from the company Coletti. That doesn't hold 10 cups of water, it holds 10 cups of coffee, so make sure you realize that. They call it 10 cup, but it does not hold 10 cups of water. Tell you guys, this thing is rugged. Comes with this little carrying case. And there's your press. It is made out of AISI 304 stainless steel. Sounds very impressive, I can tell you. It feels very good quality. It's kind of like the tank meets a coffee press. Just look at this thing. No little skimpy handles. This thing's a big old grab handle. And it's got a couple other things that make it a little bit different than your average coffee press. You can use it inside, but it is not made for the indoors. It is engineered for the outdoors. Dimensions are seven by 4.5 by 9.25. Weighs a pretty hefty 3.2 pounds. Volume inside is 42 ounces. It has one millimeter stainless steel walls with two millimeters of vacuum sealed space in between. So one millimeter, two millimeters of space, one millimeter of stainless steel. So very hefty construction. Has an airtight, and let me tell you, it's a airtight because it's hard to get out. Oh, there we go. This airtight silicone gasket is different than anything I've seen on almost any other uh, press. And if you just look at the construction, okay, super heavy duty. Very nice filter area, screen. Show you guys this thing. Look at the size of the walls, if you can see. The size of the walls are impressive. Has a very nice spout. And all I can tell you is, it just feels really good quality. Um, you just look at the different pieces. This is molded in. Just look at that. Super nice. Bottom if you're interested. Talk about high, high quality. Again, look at the handle. I mean, this thing is solid. The airtight gasket is really nice whenever you make your coffee. It keeps things super hot. You can put it in and you'll see that hole right there. And if you line up the little arrow, the Coletti arrow, you can see that the hole is right there. You can easily just twist it to the side. It'll be down like this and you can keep it with that silicone gasket. It keeps it super, super hot for a long, long time. The price is $65. Now that's a lot more than a lot of similar presses out there, but I think I've shown you guys why this one costs a little bit more. There's a lot of things that make it different and special. If you're an overlander or you're an avid camper, uh, and you want something you can just kind of throw around, this thing, you can throw it around. It's not going to be damaged in the least. If you pack it like this, and another good thing about that seal is that you can hold it here. Look, it's not coming off. I'm holding it by the top. So if you throw this into a bag, a box, back of your truck, back of your RV, it is not going to just come apart. And if, obviously if it was to come apart in a bag or in a box, this thing would all of a sudden become very susceptible to damage. Well. This thing's not gonna have that problem. Pop it on, it's not going anywhere. Let's make some coffee.
what makes this coffee press different? Why did I decide to review it? Well, there's a couple of things. Let's talk about what I saw. First off, it's just beefy, like I showed you guys. It's got very, very strong characteristics. The handle is strong. Every piece of this coffee press just kind of oozes quality. It's almost like it's overmade, and it's made for the outdoors. They're making it pretty much bombproof. Calling it the boulder because it's so darn tough. Design prevents spills, the way you're able to open and close. And of course, even when you close sometimes a coffee press without that silicone gasket, it's gonna very probably gonna spill. This one's not gonna spill because you can flip it all over the place and that gasket's gonna keep the coffee inside. Of course, the construction also keeps your coffee hotter, longer, which is great. I made coffee early this morning and went off and did some fishing. I've been fishing for about three hours or so, four hours, came back, Pour myself another cup of coffee. It wasn't obviously as hot as it was when I first made it. It was very drinkable and still very warm. I said it's a truly airtight product. Um, you're not gonna get any spillage or any air getting in and that really just adds to the insulating properties of it. Now, they say you can use it for cold brew. I'm one of those strong believers that coffee should be hot, but nonetheless, supposedly it works great for cold brew, especially because of that airtight seal. Now, if you want another reason to support this company, then just take a look at their website. They say they are uniquely veteran and unashamedly Christian, and that's something that I can definitely stand behind. Founder's not only a West Point graduate and an ex-infantry officer, but also a pastor with a strong passion for religious freedom. Whether you follow Christianity or any other religion, you want to be able to have the opportunity to practice your religion. I think that's very important. The company champions the freedom of speech, the freedom of press, and the freedom of religion very, very important tenets that make America, America. 10% of the profits made by this company go towards ways to ensure people's freedoms when it comes to religion, speech, or the press. They also make a really nice looking coffee percolator. It's called the Bozeman. They asked me if I wanted to check out the percolator or the coffee press. And after looking at both, I just thought that the coffee press would appeal to you guys more just because of its rugged nature. That being said, I'm sure that the Bozeman being as overly constructed or over-engineered as this particular product is, is a great product as well. So check them out. Make no mistake, you can find a cheaper coffee press out there. There's tons of cheaper coffee presses on Amazon, but those things are gonna be much flimsier. Uh, they're gonna be much more uh, apt to get damaged. If you're somebody who likes to go outdoors, like I said earlier, if you want to do overlanding in your car, if you're in an RV, if you're just camping out of the back of your car, if you're some crazy guy and you want to take a three and a half pound coffee press on the trail with you, whatever it might be, it's going to be thrown into areas. It's going to be potentially damaged by things smashing on top of it. Uh, when you're out and about, you can, uh, you know, drop things. They can end up on a boulder. They can, whatever. I mean, there's all kinds of stuff that can happen to your to your gear. We've all had gear get damaged and this thing is made to withstand a lot of abuse you're looking at a product that is built to last it's going to cost you more and that's why the price point is 65 dollars not sure if you guys are aware but i have an entire playlist on coffee it started off as coffee in the woods but it's really kind of become coffee anywhere and we're going to put this in that coffee playlist make sure you check it out down below in the comments do me a big big favor guys if you like the video hit the thumbs up down below it really does help spread things across youtube and is a tremendous benefit to my channel. If you want to make sure you don't miss any videos, hit that notification bell down below and make sure you're subscribed. As always, guys, I appreciate you checking out the Paleo Hiker MD channel. Check out this awesome product from this really nice company. Appreciate Coletti sending it out to me. Hope you guys liked it. Thanks for watching.